Good morning and welcome back to another episode of Workout with a Trooper. My name is Jerry O'Malley. I'm the fitness coordinator here at the Massachusetts State Police Academy in New Braintree. This morning, joining us to my right, Trooper Michael Wilhite, and to my left, Trooper Scott LaPointe of the Health and Fitness Unit are gonna help us through this workout. So a couple things I'd like to happen before uh, starting is I want you to get permission from either mom or dad or your guardian at home. Make sure it's okay to uh, work out. Secondly, that you have no medical conditions that would preclude you from fully participating. Having said that, before we start this workout, we're gonna go ahead and start with a warm up. So walking in place, hands out to your side, palms facing downward, fingers extended and joined, some arm circles forward. And the purpose of the warm up again is to increase body temperature and get the blood circulating to all the muscles that may be involved in the workout uh, that we'll be doing this morning. Okay, let's reverse direction, go backwards with those arm circles. Maintaining that walking in place. Good. From here, we're gonna segue into high knees. High knees, so getting those knees up nice and high, basically running in place. Good. Circulating that blood to the extremities and increasing core temperature. The goal here. Now we're gonna segue into side straddle hops, AKA jumping jacks. Straddle stance, hands overhead, palms facing forward, fingers extended and joined. Okay, good. From here, we're gonna go back into walking in place, hands out by your sides, palms facing downward, rotating those arms forward, shoulder rotations, good. Good, let's reverse direction with those shoulders. Rotating backwards now, walking in place, good. All right, let's segue into high knees. Getting those knees up nice and high. Running in place. Increasing core temperature. Circulating that blood to the extremities and to the muscles that are gonna be required for this workout. Okay, and side straddle hops or jumping jacks. Palms facing forward, fingers extended and joined, stepping off to your left and then back to the star position. Good. And 10 seconds. Three, two, one, time. All right, that concludes our warm up. Let's get right into the workout. For today's workout, we have a Tabata style workout. We're gonna apply a work rest ratio of 20 seconds of work and 10 seconds of rest. We're gonna, we have six exercises. We're gonna go over the points of performance uh, in just a second. So we'll perform those six exercises for four rounds. Once that is complete, the workout will be complete for a total of 12 minutes. So for the first exercise, I'm gonna have Trooper Mike Wilhite over here to my right demonstrate the sit up and the way we do it here. We're gonna start with our back flat on the ground. Soles of our feet will be glued together. And we're gonna sit up by making our spine vertical and touching the top of our toes. And then back down and back up for subsequent reps. You're gonna to try to do as many reps as possible within the 20 seconds of work. Second exercise we'll demonstrate, uh, Trooper Scott LaPointe will demonstrate is the mountain climber. So we're gonna start with our hands underneath our shoulders, uh, left knee in toward the left elbow. And simultaneously, we're gonna kick that left knee back and bring that right knee in toward or behind our right elbow. And we're gonna continue this motion for the 20 seconds of work. The third exercise we'll do in this Tabata is the flutter kick, the flutter kick. So you're gonna lay down on your back. Your hands can be beside you or underneath your hips. Both feet will be about six inches off the ground. And you're just gonna rotate your left and right foot about six inches apart. Uh, and you're gonna continue that range of motion for the 20 seconds of work. 
For the fourth exercise, burpees, burpees. Triple point will demonstrate this. We're gonna begin by squatting down, putting our hands underneath our shoulders, kicking both feet back, either together or six inches apart, getting our chest all the way to the floor. Very important here. And then you're going to bring your feet underneath your shoulders. You can do that by picking your chest up off the floor or by doing a push-up. Uh, once your feet are underneath your shoulders, you're gonna go ahead and jump with both hands up overhead. A subsequent rep looks like this. And you're gonna do as many reps as possible for the 20 seconds of work. For the next exercise, we have the front plank. So we're gonna go into a modified front lean and rest position or a push-up position, but we're going to keep our elbows directly underneath those shoulders. And we're gonna maintain mostly a straight line from shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles. What we don't wanna see is you looking back at your toes or looking up toward the ceiling. You wanna look generally 10 to 12 inches in front of you, keep a neutral or natural spine position. So you, you wanna try to keep your hips level with your shoulders and your knees and your ankles. Try to prevent those hips going up toward the ceiling or down toward the deck, bowing. If you can't hold that position for 20 seconds, try as long as you can, and then you can go to your knees and scale the rest of that. For the next exercise, or well, the last exercise in the round will be the V-sit. So we're looking for an isometric V-sit position like so. We see the V there, and now we're, gonna, we're going to implement a rotation with the torso. So rotating the entire torso, left and right, touching both sides, not just with your hands, but by turning your entire torso. And we're gonna do as many reps of, of that as possible, maintain that range of motion for 20 seconds. Once we perform all six exercises, that'll be one round. We're gonna do four rounds of that Tabata workout for a total of 12 minutes. We good to go? All right, let's get after it. So the first exercise will be the sit-up, the sit-up. We're gonna work off of this clock, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We'll let you know at home when the buzzer sounds. And here we go in three, two, one, go! Okay, sit up by making that spine vertical and then touching the top of your toes. All the way down, all the way up. 20 seconds of work. Okay, next exercise, the mountain climber. The mountain climber. Hands underneath your shoulders, right knee in toward that, or left knee in toward that left elbow. And then you're gonna kick it back simultaneously, bringing that right knee in toward that right elbow. Continue that range of motion for the 20 seconds of work. Way to work, keep working, five seconds. Two, one, time. Okay, the third exercise will be flutter kicks, flutter kicks. Laying flat on your back, hands underneath your hips or off to the side, feet six inches off the ground. Good, way to work, 10 seconds. Five seconds, three, two, one, time. Okay, burpees, burpees. So on your feet, at the buzzer, you're gonna bring your hands underneath your shoulders, kick both feet back at that chest all the way to the floor. Here we go. All the way down, feet back underneath your shoulders, and you're gonna jump with hands overhead. Way to work. Five seconds, stay with it. Time. Okay, front plank, front plank. Starting, starting with those elbows underneath your shoulders. At the buzzer. Okay, we're up. Straight line, shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles. Feet together or up to six inches apart. Try to keep a natural or a neutral spine position. Try not to be looking back at your toes. Five seconds. Good. Last exercise in the first round is the V-sit with rotation. V-sit with rotation. Try to keep those heels off the ground throughout the 20 seconds. Here we go. And we're gonna rotate that torso up top, touching left and right. 
Keeping a nice tight core, tight belly. Way to work. Stay with it. Five seconds. Try to keep those heels off the ground. Time, end of round one. We're going to round two now. Back to the top of the order with sit-ups. Sit-ups. Shoulders back on the deck at the buzzer. Here we go, sitting all the way up, making that spine vertical, touching the top of your toes. Good, way to work. Stay with it at home. Here we go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, mountain climbers, mountain climbers. Hands underneath your shoulders, left knee in toward left elbow. At the buzzer, we're gonna kick it back simultaneously, bringing that right knee in toward that, behind that right elbow. Continue that range of motion throughout the 20 seconds of work. Five seconds. Nice, flutter kicks, flutter kicks. On your back, hands by your side or underneath your hips. Keep both feet about six inches off the ground. Way to work, stay with it. Try to keep your feet off the ground for the 20 seconds of work. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Okay, burpees, burpees. You're gonna get that chest all the way to the floor. And you're gonna get back to your feet and jump with both hands overhead. Hands underneath your shoulders. Kick those feet back, get that chest all the way to the floor. Make sure it touches or makes contact with the floor. Get back to your feet and jump. Three seconds. Time. All right, nice work. Front plank, front plank. Putting those elbows underneath your shoulders. And we're up. Straight line, shoulders, hips, knees, ankles. Maintain a natural or neutral spine position by looking slightly in front of you. Try to maintain the, this position for the 20 seconds of work. Stay with it, three, two, one, time. Okay, V-sit, V-sit, ending round two of this Tabata workout. Keeping those heels up off the ground and rotating left and right with your torso. Good rotational exercise here. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Time, that ends round two, starting round three. Back to the top of the order with sit-ups. Starting with your shoulders on the ground, sitting up by making your spine vertical, touching the top of your toes. Try to get as many reps as possible within the 20 seconds of work. Halfway there. Three, two, one. Time. Mountain climbers, mountain climbers. Hands underneath your shoulders, left knee in behind that left elbow. At the buzzer, kick that back simultaneously, bringing that right knee in behind that right elbow. Continue that range of motion throughout the 20 seconds of work. Halfway there. Okay, flutter kicks, flutter kicks. On your back, hands underneath your hips or out to the side. Keep those heels at least six inches off the ground. Maintain them off the ground throughout the 20 seconds of work. Stay with it, halfway there. Burpees, burpees, okay, on your feet. Get those hands down underneath your shoulders, both feet back, chest to the floor, back to your feet, jump hands overhead. Try to get as many burpees in. 
throughout the 20 seconds of work time. Way to work, stay with it. Time. Okay, front plank, front plank. Elbows underneath your shoulders. At the buzzer, make a straight line. Shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles. Make, maintain a nice, tight belly, a tight core. Try not to look back at your toes. Maintain a neutral spine position. Stay with it. Five seconds. Okay, V-sit, V-sit. With rotation up top. Try to maintain those heels off the ground throughout the 20 seconds of work. Here we go. Good job, stay with it. Five seconds, three, two, one. Time. Okay, starting round four, last round here with sit-ups. Sit-ups. Back your shoulders flat on the ground, hands overhead. At the buzzer, we're gonna sit up by making our spine vertical, touching the top of our toes. As many reps as possible within the 20 seconds of work. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Hey, good job. We're back to the sit-up. Fourth round, back to, as you were, mountain climbers. Left knee in toward left elbow, simultaneously kicking that back, bringing that right knee in toward that right elbow. Way to work. Try to get as many of these as, well, continue that range of motion for the 20 seconds of work. Five seconds to go, hang in there, keep moving. Time. Good, flutter kicks on your back, hands underneath your shoulders, uh, your hips are off to the side. Maintaining those heels off the ground at least six inches throughout the 20 seconds of work. Way to work, stay with it at home. We're in round four, round four. Five seconds, three, two, one. Okay, burpees on your feet, getting that chest all the way to the floor, back to your feet, jumping with hands overhead. Way to work. Chest all the way to the deck, back to your feet, and you're gonna jump with both hands overhead. All right, nice work, front plank, front plank. Elbows underneath your shoulders. At the buzzer, kick both feet back. Straight line, shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles. Neutral spine position, meaning not looking back at your toes or looking up toward the ceiling. Halfway there. Stay with it. Three, two, one, time. All right, V-sit, V-sit with rotation. Try to keep those heels off the ground throughout the 20 seconds of work while rotating that upper body, touching left and right. Here we go, heels off the ground, stay with it. Halfway there. Five seconds. Three, two, one, time. All right, that concludes this four round Tabata workout. Hopefully you're able to generate a good sweat at home and you enjoyed the workout. We'll see you next time on the next episode of Workout with a Trooper. Thanks again for joining us today for this episode of Workout with a Trooper. We hope to see you again in the future. Remember, stay active, stay fit, and stay healthy.